Welcome to Greenland Gamers. This is Jekarasug. We've got another Throwback Thursday for you today. Uh, today we are in the Super Nintendo side of the classic library, and we're going to play Operation Logic Bomb. Uh, not sure exactly what this is, but uh, I'd never played it when I was a kid or anything like that. So yeah, let's go ahead and figure out what it is together. Jalico. We've had a lot of games like on from Jalico on the. Uh, on the uh, Nintendo Online stuff, the classic library. That's interesting. Is this like showing the guy you're gonna use? you're gonna use maybe I am an Android <laughs> or something guess we'll see if that's me operation light bomb push start button okay what do we got huh it looks like the top-down stages in Contra 3, I think it was, for the Super Nintendo. Interesting. Well, let's see what we got. We got B, which shoots. Y, which doesn't seem to do anything, but I see there's a spot down there for Y. So maybe you can pick stuff up later. What does A do? Oh, A changed what was in the B with it. It looks like I'm breaking that door up there, too. Okay, so it looks like I only have two different two different weapons at least to start with. Maybe I get more later. X, X, X. X doesn't seem to do anything. Maybe it switches my Y though, since A switches my B. I don't know. Let's see. If I do R. That doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh wait, if I hold it down. Then it keeps me pointed in that same direction. What does L do? Did it do the same thing? Yeah, L does the same thing. Okay. That's cool. That could be helpful. So, aiming at something. And hold down the R button, I can just kind of strafe it. Okay. It's all here. Ooh. Bonus stage here, or secret place. Yeah, that was like something creepy. Don't want to get too close to that. Kind of frozen in place here. Oh, there we go. Are we going further this way? No. Okay. Oh, there's a dude there. Dude, they shoot fast. So I got a life bar down there. Looks like it didn't take too much out of me. Should I go in there or go the, I'll go the opposite way? I mean, the top of the Let's see. There. Oh crap, oh crap, what's this? This. Oh, there's one up there. Ow. Okay, oh crap. Where's he at? Where's he at? Oh, okay, that wasn't too tough. That doesn't mean anything. Oh crap, no, 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 no. So far, so good. Oh, man. Tell you what, this R button really comes in handy. Maybe 
maybe? Well, let me take that guy out first. I don't think I should go into that room or whatever it was, a door that I missed before. Because it looks like this one just keeps going, so maybe this is not... Scanning... Oh! Just a map. Wait, I hit select? No, start? Oh, start is my map. I wonder if it also stops the action, or if it's just a map. Okay, so I'm up here, I can go to the right. Looks so like there's a big open area over there. Okay. enemies, but not all that difficult. Ow. Okay. There's another one. How can I just step on that stuff? Oh, no. shoots in front of him, then he's not that tough. Psh. Wait, that was a lot. A lot easier than I thought it would be. Wait, what happened there? Did I pick it up or something? Intruder visual. something happening to somewhere else, so it doesn't look like I'm doing anything. thing over there maybe? Can't get to that thing. Oh, I can blow it up though. <laughs> if at first you don't succeed, shoot it. Is this where it came from? Ah, this is where I was before, okay. It's not got rid of all those weird patches on the floor that I can't actually couldn't actually get to before. <laughs> not 
sure what this is. Oh, this is recon file. I'm looking at it on the computer that I just accessed. Huh. Okay. Do I have to get out of here now or something? There's another one on the far right. And left. Okay. So this is showing the transporter. Okay. So I got me to another area here. It's got more of these weird blue areas. Oh crap, oh crap, crap, I'm out of here. No. Ah. No. I didn't get my thing yet. Well, if I didn't get my map yet, I need to find out where I can get that, I guess. Not for a map, and they have to beat everybody first. Ow. Yeah, here we go. There we go. Okay. So. through those weird areas. Wait. There's something over there, but huh. Maybe that was area one, or maybe that's an area three. This is area two, apparently, based on that two there. Oh there we go. I don't remember to hold down the R button. <laughs> Using the R button is extremely important in this game. These guys are extremely easy. Okay, so that's back where I came from. Thank you. 
Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Let me out of here, let me out of here. At least I don't have as much life as these other guys did. They're a lot faster. No, no. I blew up. Eh, let's not continue. Let's just rewind this. Because that was just a failure on my part. Let's get a little more life here. That'll work, I guess. That area. Okay. I need something here to unlock that, it looks like, probably. And open the door. Oh no, I got another here. Why can't I get in there? Almost make it in. Huh. Okay, what's going on here with this game? Did I miss something? I mean, that's a teleport spot that's blinking. I shouldn't have to go through there. That's the top of this area. Oh, did I miss something? through here again. Oh great. <laughs> so I have three. Interesting. What is this? Oh yeah. Ow. 
There's a few things here. Let's get this one first, I guess. Oh, nice. Thank you. <laughs> I love this thing. Just filled my life all the way to the top. I was wondering when I would get filled. And there's the map, okay. With this laser I can go back to that other place that I was at before, but that teleporter isn't available right now, so... It's just gonna keep going for now. Oh, this is one of those where it's not actually... Huh. No, no, no. There we go. Okay, those don't seem to die. Oh, good. No! Still. Nope, okay. Looks like everything's clear except for the teleport. Maybe this will take me back to level 2. Hopefully. Yeah. Hopefully there's not new people in here. Doesn't look like it. That's good. I'm gonna keep shooting every now and then though, just to be sure. Can I get this thing? Huh. Not one of these. Great, now the boss enemy is just a regular enemy. What the? He's got tricks up his sleeves and shoots sideways too. No. No. Okay, let's move this back.
Okay. Intruder visual. So put down like some big bomb, I guess logic bombs are the same thing. I guess I have to go straight down. Number four, oh yeah. Oh crap. <laughs> Oh well. Anyways, I've been playing this for a while. So this is a, this is a pretty fun game. <laughs> Operation Logic Bomb. I'd never heard of it. Um, didn't know what to expect, but it is actually really fun. Um, I don't even know if there's anything to complain about. Really, it, it's <laughs> it's a really fun game. Um, maybe the only thing to complain about is that there's uh, not much life to go on. Um, I had one life fill up throughout the whole thing. I don't know if you can go back to stages or something like that. It doesn't seem to be. It seems to be a one-way thing unless they make you go back to a stage. Um, but, I mean, other than that, I'd, I'd say this is a really fun game. I mean, the, the multiple weapons, they give you the right weapon you need, um, you know, when you need it to be able to bounce off stuff. I still don't know what the Y does. I assume it's something else, like maybe a, a grenade or a mine or I don't know. Something else like that, but I uh, haven't gotten far enough in the game to get that. Um, but yeah, this is a pretty fun game. It's not one of those where you just die automatically. Um, it's not one of those where you know one hit kills you or that it's so hard to dodge stuff. Um, yeah, right at the beginning, I was having a tr having trouble dodging stuff, but you know once I got used to it, it wasn't bad at all. Um, one thing I do want to point out is I was using the Pro Controller and. Uh, when I use a Pro Controller, I typically uh, use the regular D-pad on it um, just to kind of emulate what it's like uh, with, uh, you know, if I'd had a Super Nintendo controller or a Nintendo controller. Um, 
but towards the well middle of the video about I actually started using to some degree the uh, analog uh, direction and that uh, the analog joystick that helped quite a bit because I realized that I could actually do diagonal and then lock that in uh, so that helped a lot especially with the lasers being able to aim that into certain places so um, definitely recommend using the analog joystick if you're going to play this game um, on the classic library here um, but yeah uh, it like I said it was a fun game <laughs> I really enjoyed it so um, leave comments below do you guys ever play this when you were kids um, what do you think of the game any tips for me um, uh, maybe explain a little bit if if we can go back or if there's any hidden spots that I missed um, I don't know if there's any way to get through some of these places some of these maps look like there should be some ways to get through it but maybe it's just later on when you reach a different level it's you know a different area I guess maybe that's when you can get to it I don't know anyways leave comments if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe tell your friends and family about this channel um, you know we'd love to have more people watching our videos we really enjoy playing them uh, so yeah, definitely subscribe to Greenland Gamers and get everyone else to do so too. And uh, thanks for watching. You have a great Thursday.